Hi, Cancer. Welcome to your September reading. Something... Let me turn on the light. Okay, something told me today to film for you guys. I, I recently filmed your, um, like, your mid-August reading. I know it's September, but, um... I was like, I should maybe do other signs because they just got a reading, but here I am because I even asked my cards who I should film for and then they said Cancer. So here we are. This is for Cancer September reading. If your Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus sign is in sign of Cancer, these messages are for you. Uh, for those of you who are new here, hi, hello, and welcome. My name is Victoria from BX Prada. Um, let's get into it, Cancer. Let's look into um, overall vibes. Let's see. I mean, let's start off with like, what do you need to know right now? Um, for September. So Spirit, what can you tell me please for Cancer right now, please Spirit. Also guys, don't look at my nails. I'm getting them done soon or I'm taking them off <laughs> soon. And you know, speaking of this, if you like to book a personal reading with me, the link is in the description box below. And special shout out to my Patreon. Um, Patreon is where you get early ad free access to all of my YouTube content. So shout out to Patreon. Okay, so first and foremost, we have Clock. Um, t need time, takes time, in time, cycles, time to heal, progress. Okay, so something is just taking longer than anticipated cancer. I'm also seeing that slow and steady wins the race. So something is really just a question of timing, all right? You just have to let things process. So some of you are waiting to hear back about something or waiting to hear back about someone. There's something here about your your request has been processed. Something is processing, okay? But yeah, some things take time. Now, another thing, Cancer, um, the universe could be slowing things down around you so that you have time to prioritize your own healing okay next up we have not enough frustrated in relationship lack of confidence self-sabotage fear slash ego issues and jealousy all right so this could be an indication of what we could be healing from okay it could be this is how we we were feeling frustrated in a relationship whether it's current or past um or there's someone that we are dealing with that's that's self-sabotaging they are the ones hitting us with this ego issues this jealousy so anyways listen to your instincts cancer because not everyone around you wants to see you win and unfortunately i think that you already know this unfortunately i think you've already experienced something like this but yes there's something here you're feeling frustrated over your love life or you're just feeling frustrated overall it could even be a career issue with this lack of confidence card okay um bottom deck we have acts so breakup separation stop the pattern silent treatment abandonment okay so is someone giving you the silent treatment cancer is what i'm wondering okay but some of you there might be a breakup a separation on the horizon or this is something that you are healing from okay but don't be thinking that you're not good enough cancer no matter what it is that's just not going your way whether it's love or not please don't let that reflect how you see yourself please Again, something is processing. Something just needs time. Now, there is a cycle that is closing, okay? And there's just something here about you ending some sort of pattern. It doesn't need to be in love, but it could be, okay? Um, let's look into your love life, though. Let's see Let's see more for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus in love. Let's see more for Cancers in love, please, Spirit. Let's see more for Cancers in love this September, please. Please take a moment to give this reading a thumbs up. <laughs> okay, too many cards fell, so I'm putting these back. Like, I'm so sorry. I can't do all that. We literally have the Tower card, <laughs> and then we have the Temperance. Okay, so things kind of go a little crazy, Cancer, in September. Something unexpected could be unfolding when it comes to love, and, you know, it might be very chaotic and scary in, in the moment because something is no longer what you thought it was. There's an entire foundation that's crumbling, but the thing is, you are going to be freed from this, okay? Whatever this tower moment is, it's going to bring you closer to yourself. It's going to bring you closer to your own spirituality. It will bring you closer to it's just going to be protecting your peace so please don't be frustrated with the timing of things again it's all about timing you're frustrated that this connection didn't work out you just started to get to know someone and then all of a sudden i don't know you get ghosted or something like that something blows up in your face all right it seems stressful it seems crazy all right but it's literally for your own protection with the temperance card okay we have the two of swords in reverse so there's a decision that is being made in love okay we have the knight of wands bottom of deck king of wands and then we have the star card so someone you could be dealing with a fire sign leo aries sagittarius but regardless of the sign i feel so maybe this person was too 
childish for you i just feel so you know that you deserve better with the star card here so you're gonna align yourself with better this person this situation or these patterns in love this is not your destiny this is not where you are meant to end up in okay so some of you are gonna decide to walk away or the decision will be made for you okay but you're going to be okay cancer like you're gonna be okay you're gonna be okay i'm gonna <laughs> we're gonna look into your career and finance sorry i don't i'm not laughing it's just this the messages were just really really upfront like just very direct some of you might be dealing with a scorpio also there could be emphasis here on a scorpio placement um with the tower card that's like mars energy it could also be aries um but we cover that with the with the fire signs okay let's look into career and finance for you guys Let's look into the career and financial situation because I feel like you're worried about something, you're overthinking something, and I just want to know more. So Cancer, career and finance for September, please, Spirit. Career and, oops, career and finance. Oh my gosh. Okay, Cancer, I don't know what it is, but it's like a lot of you feel trapped. Okay, we have this Six of Cups. So there's something here about becoming financially independent from your family possibly or from a place that you you've just been devoting a lot of time and energy into something it could be your work but it could also be your family your living situation your neighborhood there's something here about you moving away or breaking free from that so like i said some of you could be becoming financially independent you're moving out from your home you're moving out from your from your parents home possibly okay we have the hermit card you're healing from something cancer I think time alone is going to be great for you. I just don't want you to overdo it and to like cut yourself out from everyone that you've ever loved. Okay. But there's something here also about some of you working from home. Okay. But there's definitely a new adjustment, a new cycle that is ending when it comes to your career and financial situation. Also, when it comes to your living situation, it's possible. I just feel so it's mostly something that we have to like mentally and or emotionally overcome or work through okay and it may require a period of isolation for a little bit just for us to heal catch our breath sit and think for a second but at the bottom of the deck you literally have the two of wands this is my success card this is my victory card this is also my card for promotion so some of you are aligning yourself with uh, a better pay okay a better living situation you're gonna be successful you're worried about doing something on your own you're worried about branching out some of you might even be worried about what people are going to think of you it's going to work itself out the only thing getting in your way cancer is yourself your own mentality okay some of you it's the lack of action it's that lack of initiation that is what's holding you back now we do have the seven of cups this is my card for you know when it's easy to get lost in the sauce you do have a lot of opportunities coming up for you in career finances whatever it is um i also feel as though yes yeah, so you have a bunch of doors and opportunities coming up it's just very important that you're going to be intentional okay because whatever you do next is going to be very successful very lucrative okay and we need to take action but we also have to like plan things accordingly we have to be strategic okay that's the thing cancer we have to be strategic so don't be just accepting the first offer that comes up whether this is a love offer a career a job offer or a living situation don't say yes to the very first offer that comes up because something better is even is around the corner okay um but yeah i don't want you getting all like I don't know it's kind of making me think of like someone that was sheltered and then all of a sudden they get a glimpse of like um, freedom and then they kind of make the wrong choices so there's still something here about don't be overspending this month don't be doing the most all right just carefully align yourself for what it is you know your next move has to be and then make that move we need action we need action cancer okay I'm gonna go ahead and um pull a prayer and affirmation card sorry i have my tv on for my puppy and i thought i had something let's let's pull a prayer and affirmation card i feel so this is what you need cancer i hope that you guys enjoyed i'm doing very quick readings today i did not like we don't have time to be doing 20 minute reads but if you'd like a personal reading with me um go ahead and book the link is in the description box below um i am doing a sale like mini love readings um they're 22 dollars i accept paypal and cards like credit cards um but yes essentially we just pull on um how your person feels about you <clears throat> right now and if you're interested just dm me on twitter or instagram at vx prada 
And yeah, you guys, let's get a prayer and affirmation for cancer. So this reads competition. I am yours alone. Okay. It reads, change me, divine beloved, into one who can trust that you alone are the source for all. Free me from the illusion of scarcity and competition, period. Okay, so you don't have to be fighting for anyone's attention. You don't have to fight for anyone's love. You are enough as you are. Some of you are also breaking free from this family situation. Okay, some of you may be cutting ties with family members also. Okay, um, let me trust that all needs are always richly met. I am yours alone. Okay, so Cancer, you have everything that you need within you. You have the universe backing you up. I'm sorry about my camera focusing. Um, you are good enough just as you are, right? Because whoever told you you weren't good enough or whatever circumstances, situations, or patterns that were making you feel otherwise, that's don't even listen to that. Okay, Cancer, I hope that this was helpful in any way. I wish you the best, and I will see you next time. Bye.